Have you heard the expression, thing in itself? Hello everybody, my name is Grimitius and welcome to my channel. We are playing a brand new game, thing in itself, which is apparently based off a philosopher named Immanuel Kant, who came out with this philosophy called Thing in Itself. Um, just a brief version of what Thing in Itself means, apparently something to do with the fact that your reality is made up of your perception and therefore each people has different reality. Uh, I don't really, I'm not really a philosophy kind of guy, but it does strike me as pretty interesting. And uh, I don't know, the graphic itself wasn't, isn't like super great. It's pretty basic, pretty simple, but I don't know. The, the, it just, it just seems interesting to me, like the whole philosophies, and I don't really know how does it work. Uh, but from what I understand, it's more of a simulation, and it's more of a short story than an actual game. So, so we shall see how is it going to play out. Uh, I understand that this game is not going to take too long. I'm just going to check my time right now. It is. Okay, it's not going to take too long. Apparently, it's like 15 minutes walkthrough on average, so we shall see. Uh, let's begin the story. Thing itself is an interactive short story. Yes, we heard that. It is not a game in a traditional sense, it doesn't present a challenge to the player, and doesn't have win or lose conditions. We hope you enjoy it. I hope too. I hope you enjoy it too! There's no like uh sound, so I hope my voice isn't too loud or isn't too soft. Prologue. It's so dark here. I can't even see my fingers. Like we're in a cardboard box. I know. Good thing we're actually in a bed in this spacious room. It's not that spacious. But it's bigger than a box, right? I guess. This is so Although, I used to like playing in those when I was little. I imagined I was a princess in my own castle. I've never played in a box Did before. you do anything like that, Teddy? Okay, so I'm Teddy? Uh, not really. Not really. I guess I was more of an outdoors child. I liked parks and swings better. I was pretty outdoor yeah, when I was a child, I can but see that. I grew up being more And I was a huge bookworm <laughs> back then and barely left my room. Did you have fun at the party? Yeah, I did. Thanks, Molly. Your friends are great. Wine was great. The music, though. I'm, I'm so sorry about that. Uh, it's not your fault. But I think my ears still bleed a little. I know. I was one song away from a mental breakdown. What I don't get is... is everybody there heard the same sound, right? From the same freaking air vibrations. If we hated it so much, how come they were so into it? Okay, that is well, thing in itself. I can see two options. One, we are judgmental assholes. Ouch. Or two, have you heard the expression thing in itself? Sounds familiar. I mean, I... I... That sounds familiar. What is Watch it again? It. It's a philosophical concept like by Immanuel Kant. Kant. I think it could help us rationalize our shitty moral character. Which Kant probably didn't intend it for. That one. Tell me about that one. Okay. So, imagine there is nothing around you. Nothing at all. And think of one specific object. Mm. I think I'm editing. Let's just be quiet. Say that chair from your room. So you know what it looks like. How big it is. How much it weighs roughly. Yeah. That's what you think. Guess what? That stuff is completely irrelevant to how it actually is. Okay. Everything in the world, every single object, you see through a prism of who you are. It is your own version of it, not its real self. Okay. To you, it seems light, but a child, for instance, would think it's huge, immovable. You think it's brown, but maybe I see it as blue, and, um, Henry here sees it as green. Who's to say who's right? I have always thought but about Henry that. Is what a if fish. I perceive Doesn't colors he see it in black different? and white? That's dog silly. <laughs> Damn. What if different people see? see colors different? You think you know something, but you don't understand its true nature. And the essence of any given thing will always be kind of a secret to you, or a thing in itself. Long story short, the tasteless music you hear is totally shaped by yourself. Oh, <laughs> good. The good part is that it's nobody's fault. Bad part is that people will never truly understand each other. That's kind of true. Sounds depressing. Wow, that is fascinating. And kind of depressing. Yeah. Be careful what you ask for, Teddy. Life is a depressing thing sometimes. Oh, is that a truth? I'm so tired. I'm gonna shut down, okay? 
You know, Molly. What? I'm really happy we met. Me too. Thanks again for hanging out with my friends tonight. It was lovely. So they are a couple? Act one. Okay. Oh boy, I forgot that I live in garbage. Molly will come at 7. I should quickly clean up before that. Or before the trash will take over and dissolve my body, which honestly might happen sooner. Okay, uh, sure. Things got out of hand this Sunday. I saw this in the trailer, so... It felt so warm with her under the blankets. Okay. Not hot, the not stuffy, just horrible. warm. Uh... How do I move this? Boop. Ah! Okay, I had to start over again. I was trying to adjust the sensitivity. It was a bit. Oh boy, I forgot that I live in garbage. Molly will come at seven. I should quickly clean up before that. Okay. Or before the trash will take over and dissolve my body, which honestly might happen sooner. Things got out of hand this Sunday. It felt so warm with her under the blankets. Not hot, not stuffy, just warm. Can I click on this? Well, I don't drink alcohol, so... Molly likes it when I wear this shirt. She says I look like Waldo's sexy cousin. That looks better. Doesn't it? I can't see my achievement is blocking. I can't access your phone. Okay. Sure. Hey. Hi. Hey. I'll let you in in a second. The buzz is broken. Wait. Wait, don't go outside. Sorry, I actually called to say that I don't think I'll make it today. Oh. Oh, the hell Yeah, it, it wasn't a very good day, and I think I just need a little space right now. Is everything okay? Um, of course. Would you like to talk about it? No, it's fine, thanks. I'll just take a rain check tonight, okay? Sure. Let me know if I can help you with anything. I will. Thanks for understanding. Hope you have a good night. You too. Huh. Oh. Did you hear that, Henry? Looks like it's just you and me tonight, buddy. Hi, Henry. Oh, that was fast. You have one unheard message. How do I read message? Hi, Ted. Hi. I wanted to do the semi-decent thing and talk with you instead of sending a text. Oh my but god. Now, I'm kind of glad I got the voicemail. Anyway, I don't think we should see each other anymore. Fuck. I know everybody says that, and... That everybody says they know that, but I swear it's nothing you've done. I just can't manage a relationship. I thought I could, but I was wrong. It's just not working out for me. Don't wait for anything. Please, go out. Maybe hook up with somebody. Or don't. I don't know. Whatever will make you feel better. Play Minecraft! Please try to be okay. Why? Oh, this is sad. What the hell? Semi-decent thing. What did she even mean by that? I thought everything was going so well that... I need to call her. Um, sure? She's not picking up. Doesn't pick up. Doesn't have a voicemail herself. Very convenient. Uh, the thing is, I would like to be angry, but I don't think I'm an angry person to begin with, so... <sighs> I just want to be passive-aggressive then. Let's not be angry yet. Yeah. There's no point in writing again. 
I know she read it. She's always on her phone. There's no point in writing again. Oh. Seriously, fuck this. What am I supposed to do now? Get out. Hook up with somebody. Or maybe I will. I think I even still have that stupid dating app on my phone somewhere. Oh, that's a love thing. Maybe I should just go and get wasted on that bottle of earthy shit she likes so much. Uh, There's no point in writing again. Why not? Let's go to the beach. Longer on the beach. Sure, yeah, why not? A little bit higher, but it's a tattoo. A tattoo, I'm fine. The hair is nothing to it. Should I reply? Yeah, I guess I'm doing this. Hello to you as well. Blonde girl. I'm from Malaysia. We don't get long. I hate waking up to a turn on TV. I don't know why, but it makes you feel guilty. Like you've done something bad or really embarrassing. Maybe I'm projecting. That is how I feel all the time now. At least I can switch the TV off. Okay. I should feed Henry. At least one of us shouldn't be suffering. I'm trying to do that. Henry? Buddy? Oh my god. No. No, no, no. Damn it. Poor, poor guy. I should take him to the bathroom and flush him away. Yeah. What the hell we should talk at really long? Okay, so he's just remembering things right now. I'm so sorry, Henry. Bye. You are a great friend. I don't want to see this. I need to talk with Molly. Nah, let's... Can I not pick this up? Oh, come on. <sighs> What's this? <laughs> if anything in the drawer that I could do, I like calling her. There's nothing here. My hoodie is actually like... Okay, so pretty much she's just everything in this room he's remembering her, which I guess what thing in itself means because you're so obsessed with your current perception that it creates your reality. And right now our reality is blue. Can we just play music? I love her. Oh, let's just see. I wish I can play guitar. Fine, we'll call her. Yeah, sent. Finally. Hi. 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 I'm so sorry. I know how much he meant to you. <laughs> I flushed him down the toilet. It felt terrible. It kind of it's not your fault, Ted. You took such good care of him. Are you okay? No. I love you. What? Ted. I know, I know. You don't want a relationship. You don't want me to get attached. All the standard crap. When I did, I'm sorry. Yeah, I'm thinking about you. In I don't know how to situation. respond. I miss you very much. That's natural. I miss you too, but it will be easier with time. It must be so hard for you to hear, but I can't force myself to feel another way. I kind of hate myself for this, actually. We had so much fun together. I know you didn't do this when you were little, but at moments like this, it was so nice to hide and play inside a box. Sex. Uh, what is plush sheet? Let's just click on that. Yeah. 
I will always be grateful yeah, for what we had silence. together. Did I? For everything. You're such a sweet guy, but... I can't do this. Please try to understand me. I thought you said it's not possible. What isn't? To really understand anybody. Oh. That's right. I did. Ted, I am sorry about all this. And about Henry. I know. Thanks. I know you will be okay. Yeah, I know I'll be okay and too. Ted? Yeah? I don't think we should talk anymore. It will be better this way for both of us. Okay? Alright. I'll hang up now. Hope you feel I better do agree, soon. Like, when you get the breakup, it's best to Bye. just cut the connection, just let it move on. Bye. Oh my god. About this, it feels kind of sad <laughs> um, how things just disappear and everything. Uh, yeah, this is definitely not a game, this is definitely more of a short story to, I guess, just to describe what philosophy is, thing in itself actually means. Uh, I kind of get it, you know, like different people take breakups differently, those who are the one who did a breakup, and those who actually don't get broken hearted. Yeah, um, not too sure how I feel about this. Huh. Oh well, but I guess it's a good day to start my day this morning. So, I guess we're gonna end it here now. A very short game. So I guess that's it for now. Hope you guys enjoyed this episode. If you do, please subscribe or like. And we shall see you next time. Goodbye.